You must have seen it, the red rear light on Formula 1 cars that flashes occasionally. But what is the purpose of the light and when does it turn on? We will explain this in the new fact checker. In terms of appearance, Formula 1 cars can hardly be compared to the cars you'd see on public roads every day in your life. They're designed with only one goal in mind, to get one person across a circuit as quickly as possible. However, there are some similarities. Even though a Formula 1 car does not have any headlights, it does have a red rear light. This light is mounted on every car 30 centimeters from the ground and has three functions. First of all, it can simply be used as a rear light. Wet conditions can make it difficult sometimes to estimate whether someone is driving in front of you and how far away they are. Therefore, it's possible to keep this light on constantly for safety reasons. The race management will instruct the teams if and when this should be done. Nowadays, the cars also have additional lights on the rear wing to improve visibility even further. The rear light also has a warning function in good weather conditions. If the light flashes, it means that the car is driving a little slower than usual. This is due to harvesting of energy with ERS. The car brakes a bit heavier, slows down on the straights a little. The next driver is then able to anticipate this when he sees the lights flashing. Finally, the light can also be shown green, which is the third and final function of the rear light. If the driver is a novice in Formula 1, he drives with the green rear light on. This means that it's his very first time in Formula 1 and it often means that the driver does not own a super license yet. The green light simply warns other drivers on track about the rookie. The lamps on Formula 1 cars are resistant to all kinds of conditions. They're waterproof and built very strong to be able to withstand the G-forces. The rear light can handle no less than 50 G. 